morning. Well, it's morning where I am. This is Judy Adele, and I am going to be doing a music video reaction. I have no idea what song I'm going to be reacting to. It is all the DJ's choice. So let's see what we're looking at today. Okay, I just have to say, <laughs> I loved Rick James when he came out, and I love his sparkly hair, and his sparkly outfit, but his sparkly hair, I was just like, how cool is that? How do we get my hair to be sparkly? Not so much. Okay, anyway, fun song. She's a very kinky girl, the kind you don't take home to my father. Get her off the street, oh girl. She likes the boys in the band. She says that I'm her all-time favorite. When I make my move to her room, it's the right time. She's never hard to please. Oh no, that girl is pretty wild. No, girl's a super freak. The kind of girl you read about. That girl is pretty kinky. that I have seen a many, many years ago, but it is wild to watch it now. Everybody sing. Super freak, super freak. She's a very special girl. From her head down to her toenails. Yeah, she'll wait for me backstage with her girlfriends. In a limousine. Three's not a crowd to her, she says. that the women are actually wearing all different types of clothing um like just they're not all dressed in in tiny little outfits um i don't know what the idea about that was but i'm just saying i appreciate the fact that um it isn't just only women who are scantily clad that it is you know yeah that people are wearing i think i saw a lady in a blazer and jeans anyway. yeah. reading an article in People magazine that talked about him uh, getting his hair done um, and the uh, and the cornrows and that his, um, I don't know what the appropriate word is for 
the type of hair, but that is what they called them in the magazine at the time, um, that his mom did that. Um, and I thought that was just super cool that his mom did his hair. Like, I love that. Um, you know, and I have to think back to, to watching this video of how much did Rick James teach me about sex? <laughs> Because I remember my mother expressing concern. Um, I had this album, um, and I like I you know he had a couple. I don't remember how many hits off this album, but I remember I liked a good chunk of the album. And I definitely uh, you know I was a young kid, definitely a um, more uh, of an adult themed album. And my mother expressed concern, which actually made me pay more attention to the. <laughs> to the lyrics um to see what I was missing um but yeah I I I know Rick James isn't with us anymore and I don't remember I know that there were drugs and various other things that that for him were going on and I don't remember what actually ended up um killing him um but and I didn't pay a huge amount of attention to him after after the first album. Um, I know I heard bits and things from him, but um, I didn't keep up with his music career. But I absolutely loved that song, and it was great. It was a great dance song, and it was fun to sing. And you know, when you're a kid, that's all you care about. <laughs> and I wasn't really into kid music, so uh, so I was kind of you know into the popular stuff. Um, yes just thinking back to my childhood and listening to that song and how much of an adult themed song um that is and <laughs> and singing the lyrics as a kid and half understanding them and half not i'm sure i'm sure uh i'm sure many of you can can relate so uh fun song yay good um uh, morning get you going kind of tune a little a little jamming and keeping the body moving uh, so, a couple things um, that I want to want to um, mention about this video. So, first of all, um, this video, this song, um, I have learned that Rick James never actually got like the royalties for this song. So, this song apparently is one of the most highest, most often played, and highest paid for royalties, I think is what I recall from what I learned. Um, but Rick James got none of it. So when he died, he, you know, he didn't die apparently in grand wealth, as one would think, for uh, as popular as this song and some of his other work was. Um, so that is its own tragedy. And when we think about, you know, people talking about how the artists get paid, they're the ones doing the work. They're the ones that are the face of this. Uh, and it's just hard to believe that so many artists uh, in the past have walked away with nothing and are are living um, financially very thin lives um, because of that. So that's number one. And then <laughs> I've been trying to put together thoughts on the whole concept around the video. We can listen to the song or, you know, uh, thinking of this from a feminist point of view, um, right? Like, uh, like, looking at the lyrics and thinking about the lyrics in my mind there are positives and negatives about this song and this song was done in the early 80s okay so let's let's go back to that and thinking about where that was then and i know one of the lyrics of the songs is um is getting her getting her off the streets right so uh, as me and my dj were having this conversations about just kind of the whole um beginning of of pimp culture in a sense and but what I think is cool about this particular video, um, pretty low budget video, which is just fine. Um, what I love to see, and again, you can make an argument for or against this. Um, when I think of my little kid brain and, and my not so little kid brain, you know, so this song is a very sexualizing towards women's songs. And if we take out, again, I, I'd almost have to really go look at the lyrics even more um, in a critical mindset um, because this is one of those songs that it is the good beat takes you over and you I don't necessarily think so much about the lyrics um, on my more thoughtful days I do but what I love about this is if you're looking at this particular picture um, we're talking about women being freaky and and his positive perception of that and these are women that are dressed all different ways right they're not all in bikinis or 
um, or whatever. And I'm not saying that that's a bad thing, but what I am saying is when I think of my little kid brain, um, I would watch this video and my mind would have gone, I, I can be in this space. This is a space that I could, I realize I'm, I'm this, when this song came out, I was like in third grade. <laughs> um, but I would see in a sense myself in this video and would feel included. If this was a group of, um, you know, sometimes as women, um, it gets really, when you feel like it's kind of in your face and it's very judgy about, you know, women can only look a particular way, you start to not see yourself and it starts to kind of feel crappy. Um, I feel included here, where if this was a group of all um, just say, you know, say women in, in really scantily clad bikinis. Um, and not that that's a bad thing. I'm just saying that it then kind of has me feeling like, okay, that's them. That's them. This is me. Um, and again, I'm not explaining this incredibly well, but hope some people, especially women out there, probably catch my drift. <laughs> um, so I just want to say my my appreciation for the variety of women, the variety of age in this video um, as his backup people, um, the variety in clothes, you know, you got women in blazers and, and suits and it's just cool to see and women in the, the outfits are, they're fun, they're like fun dresses and that's really cool too. So I'm probably explaining myself really badly um, and if you stuck with me this far, thank you for <laughs> <laughs> for letting me try to explain this because this is this is a conversation we could have three hours of philo philosophical discussion about about various even lines in the song quite frankly um and i'll stay away from that for the moment so if you can throw that in the comments we can have that conversation i'm totally good with that all right thank you so much i hope you uh i hope you enjoyed the groove as much as i did um this is my first thing in the morning and it's a good uh a good energizer boost boost to get me going so i hope it serves you as well thank you so much for watching please like the video subscribe to the channel check out the other videos that we have and please comment love your comments about your memories about songs as well as your suggestions for other songs and other artists so have a great day thank you so much Bye-bye, and until next time, enjoy the music. <laughs>